All right, well, he was known for taking science to the extreme. He was the first to go viral with the soda and Mentos eruption on YouTube. Now his online demos have more than 200 million views, and his syndicated Fox show, DIY Sci, is heading into its second season. Now, earlier in the show, he lit Rick's hands on fire. Steve Spangler is back. Thank you for well, doing that, Well, thanks by for the, the intro. I really thanks, appreciate Steve. that. I'm a little nervous really, to be really out here fine. right now. So this time we're going to make Abby disappear. Is that right? Well, yeah, yeah. You know, it, it, no one we're, we're here yeah. because we're trying to make science fun. Parents right now are talking about STEM, uh, trying to get our kids excited about STEM. We're here in New York introducing our new Spangler Science Club. So it's a kid of the month club, and we're doing that at the Toy Fair. So parents are taking charge, and so we just got to have things that are fun. And how do people find out about this uh, scientist of the sure. month? Sure. SpanglerScienceClub.com. That's sure. where they're going to go. Hey, uh, Abby, would you mind just put on the glasses? You guys want me to disappear? Yeah. You're going to be great. Go away. No, you're supposed to say yes. <laughs> <laughs> Abby, this is a biological stain. So you have to be really, really careful. Oh, I'm so, oh, Abby, so sorry. Sorry. Not, not, a, pro not a problem at all. Not a, look, it's disappearing ink, ladies and gentlemen. And the way disappearing ink works is it uses carbon dioxide in the air. Are you cold now? I'm sorry. No, I'm Carbon dioxide in the air, and it changes back. The problem is we don't have a lot of time for that, so that's why I brought this. I think you're going to... See that great? Look, it's disappearing. The ink is going. So it's, it's perfect. I think I need a raise. You're yeah, great. Gosh. Isn't that great? Here, turn just a little bit. Here we go. Oh, that's good. That's good. Perfect. Sorry, guys. I'm still here. See? I'm still here. Look at that. The stain disappearing like you wouldn't believe. Hey, come here and take a look at this. I want to show you. Everybody, safety glasses hey, on. I burn some gummy worms. You know what? When people say kids are on a sugar high, this is what they mean, sugar high. Uh, there's a tremendous amount of energy that's here, and so Rick, you and I are going to uh, to do this. I'm gonna I'm gonna put it down inside since your hands are in, are you know they're insured for TV and everything. Yeah. So, oh, yeah. so look at this. He so here's our gummy worms. Worm. He's got hand so insurance. So our gummy worms, of course, sugar, tremendous amount of energy, uh -huh. and so that's gonna go down inside. We have a, an oxidizer in there that we've liquefied. So if you take a look at that, you can kind of see it close. I don't trust you, Steve. I'm just gonna oh, come right it's out. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> so now here, watch what happens when we drop this down inside. You're gonna start to see. Oh, look at that violent reaction. Amazing! Look at the energy that's coming out. No, don't touch. There you go. Yeah, no, don't touch. Look at that. Oh, that's look at that. about to blow. Fire that comes out. And wow. once again, the fire department will yeah. now show up the for another side. Isn't that a tremendous? So when we're talking to kids about there's energy in here and energy in your food, I just need things that are visual, things that are experiences, things that kids will go, what is that all about? And that's how we're going to interest them in science, technology, engineering. And hey, math. you know what? You said something to me earlier. I just want you to say this. Nine, tell me this, this set. Ninety percent of kindergartners today will, today will end up in a job that doesn't exist now. Right, that we haven't invented. So we got to prepare teachers and parents hey, to get kids. Hey, hey, hey! hey. Get oh, away. Hey. We're oh still here, though. Yeah, it's Steve, great to see you this morning. I really appreciate you. Uh, would you mind coming back every weekend? Yeah, we're going to come back tomorrow. <laughs>